What is going on, my fellow ones? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, we are doing the watch party for uh, episode seven of the 16 show. That is the show that shows us the formation of twice uh, the group. Uh, if you have not done a watch party with me before, it's pretty simple. I can't actually show you the episode in this video and upload it online to YouTube. Uh, otherwise, the video won't go live and my channel is uh, in danger. So the next best thing is you have to find the episode yourself. Uh, to give you reference to the episode that we are watching, this is episode 7, and the episode is 1 hour, 2 minutes, and 23 seconds long. Over here is a timer that shows you where I am in the episode, so right over here is the seconds, this is the minutes, this is the hour. We will be we will be hitting the 1 hour mark. Uh, there are no mid-roll ads on this video to keep one continuous flow, so if you'd like to become a member of the channel, it's not required, but always appreciated. And finally... Um, when we do our countdown, you'll hear 10 beeps. You will hear me count down from 10. When I say click play, you click play. We're watching it together. One continuous flow. That's the watch parties uh, in a nutshell. Okay, I have the episode up. Let me get it in position. And then we will... Um, actually, I'll put it over here. <laughs> um, and then uh, you'll hear a countdown from 10. Okay. <clears throat> so, from 10, here we go. 10... Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, play. All right. Mnet, 20th anniversary. Show me the money. 15. Okay. I shout out what I see for the beginning. Recapping the majors. JYP. Viewers' votes are starting to settle in. I haven't forgotten what you did, JYP, by the way. With Momo. Nonsense. This is some BS, bruh. It is hard to accept. I don't like it. Recap of the camp. This is like the worst possible thing you could ever do because whoever gets eliminated is going to have a vendetta against everybody else. And is it... Well... Speed quiz. Meat. Okay. Nothing quite like a good barbecue. This is kind of messed up. They get to eat it in front of them? Did they get to eat it in front of them? Honestly, this show's demented. <laughs> I like the way Sana left. Oh my god. Wh 
What are these challenges? Oh my god. Chewie, come on. Oh. Asana is literally like dying there, dude. Ba what? The dog, the composer? <laughs> Oh my god, mom. Come on. Ostrich? Oh my god. Honestly, at this point, Sana probably doesn't even feel any pain. She can't feel her feet. Oh my god, Sana. <laughs> She's really good. Jesus Christ, that's... You get hypothermia like that. Oh, you don't want to move your feet. How do I explain this? 100 wars, 100 wins. She can't stand it. This must be a proverb I'm not familiar with. Mario? I have no clue. Chicken Little? <laughs> How did she get that right, Automator? What is happening? Oh, 
Wow. What the hell is going on? I uh, yeah, these uh, I guess these Korean proverbs would be not something I'm even remotely familiar with. You fell backwards, but your nose broke. <laughs> oh my god. That's a wrap. Really? They got the meat. What is, I guess it's like filet mignon or something. Damn. They're bonking. Watermelon. God, it's been a while since I had watermelon. Well, it's almost summertime, so I can probably get some now. What is this like? <laughs> Jesus. Oh. <laughs> Damn, Chewie ain't fooling around. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Chewy hit her, hit her, hit her, bonker. I think, I don't think it's going to be a tie. I think Chewy, yeah. Ooh. Oh my god. They are <laughs> Oh my god. Hit hit him with a stick. Oh my god. Oh my god. Self sabotage. Oh, that's not nice.
What are we going for? Revenge? I don't know. She's a cold bloody killer. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, she's Oh my god. This is brutal. She ain't fooling around. Oh my god. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, damn. Yeah, she did fall first. Oh my god. The violence in this game. Oh my god, this is not fair. They just keep falling over. Is there something wrong with that inflatable thing? Oh my god. Are we going to have a reverse sweep? If she takes out six of them, honest to God. Make her scared. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, you can't be pulling on hair like that. Oh, my God. Oh my god. We might actually get the reverse sweep. Oh my god. She's finally in her element.
Honestly, she's on a roll. I think she might win this. All right, we're starting off with intimidation tactics. I like how we don't even hit each other with the hammers anymore. We just straight up go, no, 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 my God. She's 14 years old? Oh, my God. Oh my god, this is the most violent game I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my god. I'm never going to play pool games with them. Jesus Christ. Straight up just drown you. <laughs> oh my God. Factual. <laughs> I can imagine.
<laughs> of course. This is a really... I don't know how I feel about this. They would know each other the most, so they would know the qualities of each other more than JYP, because he's not going to be around them all the time, especially when he's not in front of them, because when he's in front of them, they're going to act their best. But this is really risky. Oh my god, is he going to watch them think about it? And I have to also mention, the people who have been there the longest, that have the most experiences, are either the most benefited from this or the mo most vulnerable. I was going to say, can they vote for themselves? <laughs> oh, I would. <laughs> but that's not that's not humble. That's a trap. I think anyone who would write their their own name is immediately going to fail the humility section. Is this Call of Duty music? It is! I was just playing Call of Duty 4 on my gaming channel. Can you imagine if somebody was just to write something like that would go in the Mean Girls burn book? <laughs> something just so awful. It would never happen, though. Oh, please. Oh, my God. If somebody didn't get voted for, I would be mortified. There's a lot to be said about this episode, though. Absolutely.
I don't like this part. I hate this part. Especially in this competition, it, I don't. He should be doing it. Okay. I think that could be something to be said about that. If you don't talk a lot, you're not saying good things, but you're also not saying anything bad. You might just be more re reserved in your thoughts on other people, which is not a bad thing. I don't think she likes who she read. I think she's upset. Who came in first place? I'm not surprised that she came in second place, though. I'm not. <clears throat> it makes sense.
I am curious. Is it because she's so young? Exactly. Exactly. Okay. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was going to be her. I everyone voted for her. I guarantee it. Interesting. Good Lord. After this? I don't like this one. He shouldn't have done an elimination based off of this round. No, no, no. Oh, you son of a... You bait and switch son of a gun. I swear to God. Good call. That would have been really bad.
Gorilla Concert? What is that? How does one have a Gorilla Concert? Oh no, my man's dividing them up again? Oh my god, this song is so old! They're playing baseball. I like how the number, the jersey number is all 16. How big of a sport is baseball <clears throat> in Korea? I sometimes get surprised at how popular baseball is internationally. Damn, what a throw. Let's go. Perfect stance. Solid throw. That was really good. Okay. T oh. <laughs> Get a little more power behind it. Solid throw. Solid throw. Good work. Good work. That looked like good food. Brand recognition for JYP, 100%. Ah, going to schools would be pretty good, too.
I was gonna say, walking up to somebody in an intimidating fashion is definitely not a way to get them to go to your concert. You don't want to scare them. <laughs> Maybe they should do like like a mini dance on the side to get attention and then to start handing out flyers. This is a great way. Yup. Oh, they they will. Wait, what's the song say? What's the lyrics to the song? Show me your what? <laughs> oh my god. You know, I'll be honest with you, when I hear somebody win a prize, I definitely don't hear, you get to exercise with CrossFit. That doesn't sound like a prize to me. Well, maybe looking at the guy. <laughs> Also pretty curious about how popular Reebok is. I don't really see Reebok too much anymore. Although I like the brand quite a bit. Oh, that's why they need that thing.
They're doing songs that are popular, or were very popular at one point. Smart. That's really pretty. Wait, are they are they matching their makeup to the color of their phone? I think the school one and the one on the street is pretty is is pretty good. Like when it comes to the locations to get people to go to the concert. Is this the actual, like, concert? Did we just jump to the concert? Or is this a preview? Uh, it's good to start with this one. It'll get the crowd hyped up.
I've never listened to the original one, but I might like this one a lot. It's gonna weird. It's gonna be weird listening to the two p.m. version. I might prefer this one more. You never know. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Do they have some? Do they have a member? <laughs> yep. Good concert. I can't believe how much fun JYP is actually having. Good. I think we're getting an elimination. Yep, we're getting an elimination. Okay. So the episode just finished. I gotta say, uh, I enjoyed the episode. Um, the beginning with the with them, you know, still doing the 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 camp and everything. Um, I will say, <clears throat> there are there are, there are a few moments, and we'll talk about it more in the Let's Watch discussions, but. Uh, I think the the three the three attributes of a person is a good lesson. Uh, I we do know, I think J, I think JYP does this with everyone. I don't know when he started doing this, um, but he most likely uh, does this with every uh, group that he's debuting because I do know later on, he, you know, uh, Straight Kids is a group that came out after twice, uh, but he also did it with Straight Kids as well. So this is a good. Um, a good thing and we'll talk about it more because i do like what he said to the straight kids he says some i think a little bit different in this one in regards to he didn't really talk about cursing uh like the foul language um and swearing with straight kids but the i believe the three the three are still the same uh, good lesson we'll talk about them more in detail i do think and i i i think jyp knew um the people that are there longer are going to have the benefits because the people that are there longer are usually going to, if you know, if they have those attributes like we like we see, they're going to help the younger ones. So the younger ones don't have the benefit of, well, I see this person is always helping other people because if they're younger, they had they've had less training, and you know they've had less time to expose. Um, their personalities to the other members. So that was obvious. I knew that was going to end up happening. And thank God there was no elimination off this one. He shouldn't have even teased it because as much as I want to say, you know, I think that the younger members were getting more, uh, were being, it's clear and obvious that the older members were the ones that are moving into majors because of that benefit, right? Of being older. Um, you don't want to put people in a bad spot with people that they potentially might debut with when you're kind of like outing the fact that, oh, oh you know, and when it comes to integrity and honesty and everything, uh, they don't think of me like that. Um, and that's not a good thing. And thank God eliminations didn't happen. 
Uh, but uh, it can be a learning situation where the person who didn't get too, too many votes or didn't move would be like, or didn't get mentioned, where it was like, hmm, uh, maybe I should, I should, uh, you know, reflect on this. And like I said, it's not necessarily that, I don't think that any of them over there are like really trash talking each other or trash talking JYP. I mean, there might be like, God, you know, he's working his, uh, too hard. This is like, uh, you know, something like that. You know, like against JYP or something. Because who doesn't complain about their boss? Let's be honest. Who doesn't complain about their boss? We all have. Don't pretend like you didn't. You have to. Okay? Uh, and the cursing notion, the younger generation, um, you know, they, they would curse a little more often. They curse a little more um, loosely. That's something that we'll talk about again in the Let's Watch. But, um, yeah. I think that's the biggest takeaway from this episode, the three lessons um, that JYP teaches. And I hope that he instills in them, um, you have to strive for these things rather than be the perfect human being and have all three of these perfected because it won't happen uh, and it's impossible. Um, it's impossible to be a perfect person because a perfect person doesn't exist and you can't be what doesn't exist. No one on the face of the earth is perfect. We, all, we know this, uh, most people know this and... Uh, it's important to say that, um, that to strive for it and be as as good of a person as you could possibly be uh, and, and correct anything uh, that you're doing wrong. But, you know, you're going to make a mistake. You're going to have some moments where you're going to get heated. It's normal. It's part of being a human being. Uh, and I'll leave it there with the watch party uh, discussion at the very end. And then obviously we have the let's watch. Um, I'm sort of, I'm sort of binging the episodes to really, to really complete the series and get into the music again. So thank you for being a part of this watch party of episode seven of twice, 16, twice, uh, stay tuned for the let's watch discussion and episode eight watch party, uh, very, very soon as I'm, uh, like I said, binging the show. So thank you. Stay tuned twice. A big shout out to my YouTube members. Thank you so much for your generosity and your support. Thank you, Liliana. Thank you, Millie the Bean. And thank you, Kelsey. Thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it.